And welcome back again. Uh, let's drop that AK. What? I'm here with Smite, Killer MC, and Ragni. Um, Hello. excuse me, I can introduce myself, sir. Too bad. We're Fuck getting you. more and more helpless each episode. <laughs> Hi, I'm Bane Johns. I am going to teach you about spying on the ladies. <laughs> what? So anyway, uh, uh, this waiter has an important distinction in being the first brutal civilian murder we have to commit. Oh no, you have to slash the back of his neck. How will he survive? You don't, you don't have to, but it makes my life easier. Yeah, you look really remorseful about it too, uh -huh. as you saunter off into the snow. <laughs> so our, our objective here is to gain access to this party uh, where we must kill the last Russian general who was at that meeting. And, uh... And also kill a Spetsnaz agent who is after a briefcase that an ambassador at this embassy uh, is keeping. And, of course, steal the steal the briefcase for ourselves. What's in the briefcase? Uh, I don't remember. <laughs> what a shock it'll be. <laughs> it contains the soul of Marcellus Wallace. So, the only thing besides the gun and the ammo the agency left for us this time was a a bottle of poison, which we'll put to good use, I'm sure. That waiter was pretty far away on his little walk. Yeah, he, he, he really went out of his way to take a smoke break. Just wanted to be near the ocean. Just uh, yeah, I'll be back in 40 minutes, so I just gotta go smoke. <laughs> They've really upgraded the sewers this time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we got stonework in here. It's beautiful. Stop, stop that's not, looking at me! That's not how doors work! <laughs> <laughs> this guy has a lot of trouble moving around. I, I wonder how he got work as a guard. That's the only kind of work you can find. <laughs> I think this guard doesn't trust you. <laughs> So anyway, we're gonna take that champagne glass because that's important. This man doesn't fade yeah. through doors. He's suspicious. <laughs> did you just put it in your pocket? Yes, I did. It is a full glass of champagne that I just put in my pocket. So the champagne is still in there. Mm -hmm. So we equip the champagne and then equip the poison. Lightly chilled. <laughs> just, just shake it in there like, <laughs> like salt. Yes. <laughs> What kind of poison is that? I don't know. Champagne G. It's, it's actually just a um, peanut, but the victim, mm. the target, is allergic. Uh, what so, an exciting party this is. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. This is a very One just stands party. around awkwardly and moves their hands every now and then. Skrillex on the piano. <laughs> <laughs> there I'm showing all the important people on the map. <laughs> no. Okay. Oh, drinks. Even more wunderbar. I drink Love while I Dale. speak. <laughs> hey, how's it going for Dell? His Russian poison doesn't affect him that much. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there we go. <laughs> now he's gonna run off to the bathroom and die. What? Did you give uh, him a give him or poison? <laughs> Yeah, uh, so we wait for the oh, ambassador hello. to come back through a quick dissolve. And rudeness. <laughs> <laughs> Would you like some more doors? Would you like some more doors? Would you like some more doors? You're dressed as a waiter, why is he giving you food? <laughs> they should be telling you to get your ass to work. Oh. Well, now the Spetsnaz agent's holding up the ambassador. Is that good? Uh, no, it's not. Oh, well, I should do something about that instead of just standing around next to the two identical guys talking to each other. I really like this song. So, the reason I let that happen is because the Spetsnaz agent will, will uh, escort the ambassador back to his room, which contains the safe where the briefcase is kept. Uh, where this room is is randomly generated every time you start the map. 
So, you can technically just go get the safe uh, if you watch where the ambassador goes after he leaves, but then you have to figure out another way to kill the Spetsnaz agent. You're such a creepy waiter. <laughs> want some hors d'oeuvres at some point. God damn it. <laughs> Do you want this champagne, sir? Sir? <laughs> champagne. I'm watching you sleep. Have a drink. <laughs> And the ambassador, you know, we just saved his life, so he rewards us by letting us take the briefcase. Oh, mighty, mighty are you nice. Sure? Are, you, are you sure he would really? It's fine. I think he just got distracted by the wallpaper. <laughs> <laughs> I think, wow, this is really nice. Steam them! Yeah, despite the fact that that guy told me to stand still, he's not actually going to do it. Uh, those are the worst guards. <laughs> <laughs> Gone on uh, vacation? You suspicious person! <laughs> I'm going what to the Bahamas. <laughs> what are you doing? I I don't think you're supposed No. Oh, okay. The, the, someone is dead! Uh, I mean, I wanted to stop him, but he walked away. <laughs> he just kept walking after I told him to stand still. Yeah. What, what was I supposed there, he did to it again. Oh, they yeah. don't pay me enough to care. Stand still! Could, could you please, could you please stand still, sir? Excuse me, sir. Could you, <laughs> could you stand still, please? Yeah. But we've got one more thing to do before we complete this mission. Take a smoke. Yes. Actually, we're just gonna get our suit back. It's just right there. Why? Seven does a smoke. Since when did we do that? That's not. That doesn't count for silent assassin. Well, I wanted it back. Yeah, you might as well. Whatever. And we got another little bit of aggression, but got problems, Chitlin. I'm sorry. I'm so aggressive. You got anger issues. You should take example on me. I'm I'm the perfect uh, calm person. Looks like someone's got friends in Japan, with plenty of money, and some serious guns. <laughs>